Hi, and welcome to today's Tuesday Tip. We're almost at the end of the summer. We have one more month with our Tuesday Tips on common MOR findings. During your MOR, at the close of it, at the very end when the reviewer is getting ready to leave, he or she should do what's called an exit interview with you. He or she will explain to you the findings that they have found that will be put in the MOR report and or to ask you if you agree with them. The next thing we're going to talk about is going to be your response. Once the reviewer leaves, he or she has 30 days to get you the final report. And from that 30 days, you have an additional 30 days to answer the report of any findings. If there are any findings in there, there's going to be a TCD date that's going to be on the written MOR report. That means that that's your target completion date to complete or correct the findings that were found. Last but not least is resident complaints. You should somewhere in your office, on your bulletin board or somewhere, have a grievance procedure and it should have the name of your contract administrator on it and a phone number. If the residents have complaints, and I know you think that they're not legitimate complaints, but to the residents, they're legitimate. They have the right to call HUD or to call the contract administrator. Most HUD offices, when they call them directly, don't even talk to them. They take the information and they send it directly to the contract administrator. And then we answer the complaints. We start out by asking them, have you contacted management about this complaint? If they say yes, then we ask what was management's response. If they say no, then we tell them. You have to let management know that you have an issue, that you have a problem, and give them the opportunity to sell it first. Thank you so much. Hope that you guys are enjoying your summer. We'll see you next Tuesday for another Tuesday tip. But remember, the fourth Tuesday in the month is our Tuesday tip live. This time, we're going to discuss marijuana on your property, in your state, all around you. What do you do? Well, you know the answer to that, but let's talk about what happens in a state where it is legal. Thank you so much. Stay safe. See you next Tuesday.